questions that you have at this time. This is, this is the same old, same old mayor. Come on now. I've been an activist in this community for over 20 years. My dad, Mario Vara, stood in this very building, in this very atrium upstairs, speaking out on the need with the late Ray, uh, great Reverend uh, Graves, Raymond Graves, on the need for a civilian review board, a true civilian review board with teeth, with subpoena power, with no biases. And we're still talking that more than a, more than a quarter century later, Mayor, really. When are you, as a black woman, the first black woman mayor, the second African American elected to the city of Rochester, when are you gonna stop the BS and stop turning your back on your own minority culture, African Americans and Latinos in the city who continue to be abused by rogue cops? Well, thank you for, for that. And I think that we can always do better and always improve, and that's what you're hearing today. When you're listening to um, what Mr. David B is talking about, you hear uh, the frustration, and I think that we've heard that. And that is the reason why we have consistently tried to do better and tried to get it right. And we are not above doing more. And that's what you're hearing today. That's what you heard the council member just say, is that they are going to go to city council and look at, again, the civilian review process to make it more independent. You heard me talking about the fact that we need to engage more with our citizens. We've done a number of different things. We haven't sat down and not um, responded to the concerns that the community has had, and we will continue to do that. I refuse to give up. I refuse to think that Rochester is not above this, and that Rochester can't overcome this and work together to make things better. And I think that that's what we're trying to do here, and we will continue to do that together. Not but isn't it true that you've been pretty hard. silent, man? over the years, and now with a little bit more than a year left in office, you're ramping up to get the votes, especially with the word on the street, Jim Shepard may be making a run for the primary. Sir, Isn't it true sir, that for the, for the majority of your term, you've been silent, you, man? Sir, yes or no? Sir, but yes I or no? That, I, I yes think, or no, man? I think that I have done a great job of going back. The black community and the Latino community knows different, man. Well, then the next year they will have their say. They will, they absolutely they will. will. The yes, next man, year they, they will. Be able to have their say. Yes, man. We will continue. We will, we will continue. It's okay. It's okay. And Mayor, if, sorry. Hold on one second. Sure, Let me answer this gentleman's question. Sure. We will continue to do what we need to do as a community to move our community forward. And part of doing that has been to first reorganize the police department and go to a five section model. Second, we went to body cameras. Which clearly didn't work. We went to body cameras. Third, we're now looking at other ways in which we can engage the public and engage the police department and also the civilian review process. What about the body cams? So what about down. the president of so, your sir, union? You what go. about the president of the RPD union saying they're the least, sir, they're the least favorable and they're only used by three departments and they don't work? What about that, Mayor? Any comment? Do you have a question? Any comment on the body cams? Yeah. 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 This may actually be for Council 